I mean, yeah, you see it in the title. Megan Hall did nothing wrong. She was just getting some good old hard dick down and taking the long dick of the law so we as the citizens don't have to. Yo, this situation is fucking wild. So Megan Hall, an officer, found out she was getting dicked down by the whole squad. She was having sex in the fucking police department. She was having sex with other fucking officers. She was just cheating on her husband, just being a straight out hoe. Right, just out in these streets spreading her legs and turning that shit into fucking used lunch meat. I really think she took that Arby slogan to heart. Arby's, we have the meat. You know, it is wild to me that the husband took his wife back. If that was me, and God bless the motherfucker, but if that was me, there is no way in hell I'm taking a woman that openly cheated on me and got run through by a whole squad of motherfuckers. It would have been one thing, right, if she cheated with one individual on her husband. I'm not saying that's right, but it would have made the optics far better. But she was straight out getting that gok gok 3000, sucking dudes dicks, fucking them raw, having dudes fuck her bareback while screaming stop resisting. Like this shit is wild to me. There is no way any self-respecting man should take that woman back. She is for the streets. That is where she belongs. She's not a housewife. You can't make a hoe into a housewife, fellas. And a lady like that, oof. God damn, that's just a mistake waiting to happen. I'm gonna give you some Real honest take here. The husband's also to blame because it seems like the husband kind of knew what was going on and turned all his blinders on. And some people, oh, that's victim blaming. I don't give a fuck. Let's just keep it all the way real. You knew your wife was around being flirtatious and openly flirtatious with other men. You knew what she was about. You married that chick understanding she ain't going to be loyal. And you kind of reap what you fucking sow. This dude should have been able to sniff out this bullshit from a mile away. Clearly, through the reports, it shows that he was upset in the way in which some people would act around his wife. Jedediah Hall needs to man up and move on to greener pastures. Get with a woman that's going to show him the respect he deserves as a man. Now, people are calling him a cuck, and I'm not going to go that far. I think some of this is just emotional immaturity but at some point when your wife's getting fucked by other dudes and you're not doing anything about it and you take her back i'm kind of questioning are, are you really into that shit is that why you're staying around you like when other dudes fucking ram your wife and just shoot up the club like i don't i don't understand that this dude in my head's probably like oh i love it when my wife's pussy gets destroyed because i know i can't do it in what fucking way would you stay in a relationship where she got digged down by the whole police squad to the point where they probably cuffed her up in the holding cell and started taking turns fucking all holes at the same time. It was just pointless. I don't get it. I don't understand why you would take a hoe back. So young man, if you're seeing this situation, right? You have a girl that's being unloyal to you, cheating on you, just move on. It's not worth it. Jedediah Hall is 28 years old. You're young enough to find someone new and that's gonna respect you and love you for you. But when you go back to the used lunch meat that's getting run through by the whole fucking team to the point where it probably looks like mystery meat pussy, I mean, just call it a fucking draw, put the white flag up and move on. It's fucking pointless. Let me know what your thoughts are down below because I, I, the cucking in is real apparently. This, I don't understand this. I don't get it. And maybe you down below in the comment sections can help me understand. Captain Paul, see you in the next one.